Mets and Braves kicking off the second half of the season less than a week after swapping Jeff Francoeur and Ryan Church. Oliver Perez, the Mets starter on the nine, has given up on an earned run per inning coming in. And bottom two, living up to that handle. Yunel Escobar, a little bad flip, the eighth home run of the season, but he'll pick up the litter on the way over. He scores the run. Garrett Anderson then down the right field line and maybe an encouraging sign for him in the second half. That is sixth home run. Three hits in the ball game for Anderson. Goes back to back, 2 0 Braves. Top four, Gary Sheffield going up the middle for the Mets. Louis Castillo able to score against Derek Lowe. And then Daniel Murphy. Well, he'll follow up a fastball right down the middle, drives it to the gap in right center. Sheffield scores easily, and the Mets ahead 3-2. Derek Lowe gives up three runs in six innings. Bottom half of the inning, Matt Diaz. He'll get it back down the left field line. Brian McCann looking to come around. Not the greatest runner in the world. The relay throw right on the money, but McCann just in there. Real close play and worthy of another look. See Schneider trying to block the plate, but it looks like the left fingertips of McCann do get in there. Perez gives up three runs in six frames. So down to the bullpens in the seventh. Chipper Jones, the Mets killer, singles home Brooks Conrad against Bobby Parnell. 4-3 Atlanta. They add another for Rafael Soriano, and he was dominant in the ninth. Nice backdoor hook. It's Daniel Murphy, and then Jeremy Reed can't catch up to the heat. 5-3, Braves take a 13th save for Soriano. Manny Acosta earns his first win of the season. As far as the guys traded for each other, Jeff Francoeur goes 0 for 4, though he did receive a nice ovation from the Atlanta faithful. Brighton Church, meanwhile, did not start, though he did appear as a defensive replacement at pinch run. 